Hey everybody, this is Disco Sean 21. And I have a question for you. Have you ever raised your hand and pretended like you was gonna hit one of your parents? And not let's not just say pretended, but acted like you was gonna hit one of your parents. Well, when I was a kid, I did. And this is what happened. This is my story. One time, or well, one year, my parents had got a divorce. I don't know, they got a divorce like nine or 10 or something, I don't know. So I think around 11 or 12 or something, my mom used to like get on us, get on me especially, I was a middle child, so I felt like she was picking on me because I kind of looked like my dad or something, I don't know. So she used to whoop us, she had to discipline us. But when I say whoop us, she would whoop us with extension cords, belts, shoes, hangers from the TV, chain, rope, mop, the broomstick, whatever she could get in her hands. Cause you gotta remember, she's raising three kids in Compton and she wanted to keep us in a straight and narrow line. Some might say that's abuse and it was, but you know, um, let's skip that part. So anyway, so back to the story. So anyhow, she used to hit me and I got tired of it. So one day I said to myself, she tried to hit me, I'm gonna raise my hand and pretend like I'm gonna hit her back. So one day, here she comes with the plier from the TV that we used to have to turn the channels with. And she came with that plier and I raised my hand and she was like, oh, so you gonna hit me? And she walked away. And I was like, yes, it worked. So I said, next time she come, I'm gonna do it again. So something happened and she came to hit me again. This time I think she had like, the refrigerator or something in her hand. I don't know. But she came to hit me. And I raised both of my hands this time. I, I, I am not making this up. She did just like this. Grabbed me by my neck. True story. Grabbed me by my neck. And pulled out the kitchen butcher knife. And put it up to me and said, Boy, if you ever raise your hands to me again, I'll kill you. And I seen that crazy look in her eyes and I knew she was serious. She scared the bejeebies out of me. I never raised my hands to my mother again. Now, like I said, some of you guys might say, oh, that's child abuse, you know, but I understand because she was raising two boys and a girl on her own and Compton it wasn't that great at the time and she was just doing the best she could now let me say this because of the beatings that I got and the knife being pulled up to my neck and all that stuff I don't hit my kids I've never hit my kids I don't want them to feel the pain that I felt inside as well as out so there's other solutions to disciplining your kids but I think the main solution to raising especially boys is having a father in their life being it that you're their father or not you can just be an uncle a close relative a good friend but i think every young man especially a young man that has just a mom raising them needs a male role model in their life i'm disco sean 21 and i turned out i turned out all right without a daddy in my life all the time Peace. Strong women. Strong women.